guys, what is good? Welcome back to the show. It's Beaker's Lab. The gang is back. How we doing? Hey, I'm Beaker. That's Lulu. And we're here, guys, to get ready for Max Week. You guys know what it is, dude. We're getting ready for Max Week. It's almost here. In three days, it's going down. And in that time, we got a couple of things to do. But really, it's just about counting down, dude. We're getting ready for this. And right here, you can see in front of us, this is shocking, dude. This is just crazy. I love that we got to do this again. Here, Lulu, you want some foods? Here. Cool. I also got to get you some hay. I'll get that in a second. But guys, I love that we got to do this again, right? This was so much fun. I think the first thing we did when we did this, it was cannons and it was on our other base. And I loved it so much, dude, that we did it so many times. We did cannons, we did archer towers, we did Teslas, we did air defense, bombs. I can't get enough of it, dude. And I am going to miss this so much when it's gone. But the good news is we got a couple more things to do. That's what Max Week is all about. So in the meantime, let's get ready for Max Week. You know, we started that yesterday. Let's get shades on, shoes off. Actually, I already have my shoes off. Uh, you'll notice there's nothing around here anymore. During Max Week, we got to get something weird over there. Hey, guys, you know what we haven't done in a while? We haven't changed any of these skins. You know what's kind of goofy is the Jolly King. I mean, during Christmas, I kind of got sick of it. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna bring him out again. What about the Archer Queen? What do we got for skins in here? Hmm. All right, we're gonna bring Frosty Girl. Oh, she's pretty cool. Whatever. Let's go. Perfect. Are you kidding? Hang on. We we gotta take this, guys. I keep. <laughs> this morning I walked up here in a green hoodie and I'm like, oh man, like I have to take this off. I can't wear this on a green screen, but it's so comfy. I don't want to take it off. Man, we should probably just. Probably just wear it one of these days, right? We'll be completely gone, except for, well, I guess, our face. That'd be creepy. Hmm. Anyway, let's go. I am like a child when it comes to green screens. I, <laughs> I think they're so cool. I get so, like, enthralled with them. I think they're just magic. Yeah, it doesn't take much to impress me, clearly. Uh, so anyway, you know, it is good to, it is good to get psyched about small, stupid things, right? Like, if, if you get psyched about stupid things, you're always going to be happy because, you know, that, that's that's how I feel anyway. Anyway, uh, 45 queen, that queen was pretty good, but it seems like we gunned her down pretty well. Yeah, I mean, ours is 50 and we had a rage spell and we had some healers and we had a cool ice queen skin. You know, I think I, I talked about this recently, I not talked about, but I said this in a comment to somebody recently. It would be cool. And this would probably be too OP. They would probably never do this. But if you could have hero skins that gave you unique abilities. I'm talking about like ice ice abilities for this or like fire abilities for a, for a different skin. Like that would be really cool, I think. I think you would be able to do you you wouldn't be able to make it really OP. That's the only problem. Like if you did an ice queen, she would suddenly be you know, obviously pretty strong. I'm just saying though, you know, give a little bit of an ice ability to her shots. That'd be awesome. Anyway, uh, we have not started yet, and I'm, you know, kind of thinking maybe we should do that. Let's go. I can't believe our queen is still alive. And she's gunning down the town all by herself. What a champion. What a champion. All right, what do you guys want to do now? Um, yo, it looks like all the, <laughs> all the air defense are upgrading, so that's, that's good. All right, let's go. Drop right there. Drop right there. Oh, and we're distracting. We're distracting. <laughs> The Wiz Tower. We're going to drop a heal spell anyway, though. It's fine. So in there, our peck is getting roasted. Good job. Cool stuff. Um, that P.E.K.K.A. is going to do her thing, I guess. Yeah, it is a her, right? Isn't the P.E.K.K.A. supposed to be? I, I love that. The fact that, like, it's a, it's a ninja in armor, but they gave it, like, I wish they gave it more of a backstory. I wish they gave everything in Clash more of a story. I love that. The fact that... You know, they, they give so much, so little in the beginning of the game. They tell you, okay, you know what the only thing they really tell you in the beginning of Clash? They talk about Elixir and where it comes from. They say something like, Elixir from Ley Lines. What, Ley Lines are like, um, look it up. It's something about like fairies and like, uh, like, like magical stuff. Uh, but yeah, they, they don't give you really much backstory. And I wish they did. Cool. Now I've rambled for a while. Uh, does anybody know <laughs> what we started talking about? <laughs> I don't know. Ley lines, I guess. L-E-Y. Kind of a cool word. Anyway, uh, can we get out of here? Can we're going to get in the 99%, aren't we? As always, we deserve this. Thank you. 
Hey, so I just posted a video on Instagram just a like half an hour ago um, of Lulu sitting on top of her house downstairs and she was staring at the wall. Her eyes were open, but it looks like she was asleep. And somebody said in the comments, hey, you know, bunnies can sleep with their eyes open, right? And so I was wondering if you guys have bunnies, let me know. Do they sleep with their eyes open? Because Lulu sometimes has her eyes open and is clearly asleep. But sometimes I think she does sleep with her eyes open. See, like, how would you know? <laughs> She's like, why is he waving his hand? What? So isn't it funny how the first five are perfectly matched? Like they're within, what, 10 seconds of each other? And then this one is, it's not even that bad. I thought it was gonna be worse. That dub cannon, the stubby dubby, uh, is nine minutes away from, from the first one. It's not even that bad. I thought it was way more. Do you guys remember that video? <laughs> that was not one of our best, but it's all good. Man, so many things in this room are green. And I'm just always thinking like, can't have that on the green screen. Can't have that on the green. Like even this lid to Lulu's food bowl is green. Yeah. Let me check real quick. What does this look like? I think we might've worn this before. Yeah, see, if we were to put this on, I mean, <laughs> it doesn't green screen out perfectly. And that's because of uh, lighting. Lighting has to be really good for something to green screen out. Otherwise, it's gonna look like this. It's just gonna look like halfway green screened out. Uh, we have enough light in here, but not for this. Like we would have to have perfect lighting for this. This is creepy. Weird. Okay, green man going in. <laughs> green man coming for you. Um, Yeah, where do we wanna start? All right, man, hopefully green man is good at clash. Uh, let's, let's hope. So there's nothing in the clay castle there, but there was a bomb. Now, does that make sense? Or, or do bombs generate automatically now? I think they might. Yeah, I kind of forgot about that. No, but they don't. Whatever, whatever. Let's go. Okay, let's do that. I see queen, what's well, good. Yeah, see, how cool would that be if she did kind of like what an ice golem does? She slowed down whatever she shot at briefly. I'm not talking about much, but just very briefly. But the problem would be now all of a sudden, free to play players don't have the skin, right? Cause they don't get the gold pass. Like some of you guys just don't buy the gold pass. And so then you're at a disadvantage. So I think that's why Clash would never do it. I think that is the, the plus of having skins in the game because I love them and they don't change the game at all. They just change how, how the game looks. So, you know, either way, if they were gonna do uh, skins that actually gave you an advantage, they should make them free, obviously. Anyway, uh, we already used the queen ability, so we gotta be careful here. Yep, yep, bud, please, please, please. Okay, I'm gonna try another rage because I just, I can't let the queen die. There we go. What's up? What's up? Perfect, perfect. All right, man, I think we're looking pretty good. So I'm gonna hit the king. I'm gonna hit the warden. Let's go. Do this thing. Oh, this is perfect. See how we funneled so well, man? I love that. So the queen's gonna go down. I can't save her. It's too late, dude. I'm sorry, queen. Just, you know, it's been fun. Um, so let's do rage warden. Oh, I love that. You guys know I love that. That's the best combo. So sick. Uh, you don't need a free spell because you, you know, you're invincible and everything. Now we need a free spell, but Man, that was good. So now we need a heal spell as well. We're getting into the queen territory. I'm probably gonna freeze the queen. Is that dumb? Whatever, I don't care if it's dumb. <laughs> I hate the queen. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. There we go, gang. So I think we gotta take off this green hoodie. It's kind of freaking me out looking at the preview screen right here. Cool. Anyway, um, it's been fun, green hoodie. I do love this hoodie, man. It's really comfy and green. I got a lot of green, like a lot of my favorite clothes are green. Just can't wear them on the green screen. Uh, okay. But then if I had a blue screen, you know, like I was just saying, you can have a, a blue screen instead of a green screen. That'd be even more of my clothes. Like my favorite track jacket. You guys know the, the Puma one that's blue. I couldn't wear that. So whatever. Did we get another 99%? We deserve this. This is what we deserve. Hey, I just realized there was 9,000 dark on this. That's a lot of dark elixir. So was that because they have the new dark drills or was that just a lot of dark? I gotta go check because now I'm wondering, is that like the new normal? I don't think I've actually, yeah, this is it right here. 
Did you guys see our attack log? It was 98%, 99%, 99%. We're just awesome, man. Yeah. Okay, so where's the Dark Trolls? Yeah, that's level eight, dude. You guys see? Lulu's eyes are closed. I think she, I think she does sleep with her eyes closed. Hey, can I pet you? I don't want to scare you. Cool. Yeah, man, it's going to be interesting to see how much Dark Elixir you can get now with these new drills. I think it's going to be, isn't it going to be like 16,000? I don't even know. I don't even know. Let's go. Hey guys, I've seen a couple really nice comments and, and messages on Instagram lately saying like, Hey Beak, you know, I've gone through some depression lately and watching your videos, especially like your series lately has really got me through. And I love that so much. And I would really recommend you guys like just have something stupid to look forward to. That has helped me so much. Having just had just the simple fact of me getting up here every day to do a video has helped me so much. Dude, if we were to take this, this would be reverse scrub of the day which <laughs> reverse scrub of the day sounds like something nasty uh it's not it would just be us attacking someone that would be scrub of the day if they attacked us you guys want to do reverse scrub of the day let's do it <laughs> All right, guys, welcome to the first ever reverse scrub of the day where we're going to try to attack somebody that we should not be attacking, nor should they be attacking us. But you know what? It's a dead base. I think it's going to be fine. I forgot to drop the golem first. What am I doing? You know what it was? I thought we had a queen walk. <laughs> that is definitely what just happened. But I think we're going to be okay here as long as we can get in. Ah, this is never going to work. I didn't really, didn't really set this up right. You know, this might help us right here. This might help us right here. Uh, I am probably going to freeze... I just want to freeze that stupid scatter shot. I hate that thing so much. Okay, get in there. Cool, awesome. So we still got a queen ability. We've, uh, should we drop the warden with these guys? Yeah, sure. Let's do it, man. Reverse scrub of the day. All right, guys, uh, what do you want to do with the, you know what we got to do, right? We got to go over here. That's definitely what we got to do. All right, man, Um, we got a couple of hay spells. I don't really know what I want to do with them though. Hmm. I'm gonna hit a race ball right there, get things moving. Oh, Luli having some water? Good, stay hydrated. All right, so over there, guys, we got a bunch of wizards, it looks like. We're, we're doing okay. Let's drop everybody else in here, and we have a clone spell. Now, I hope I can clone the correct thing. I don't know what that is gonna be, but... Um, okay, let's hit that. Let's rage. Let's freeze that. And let's try to clone some balloons, is what I really wanna clone. Ah, we cloned a dragon, no! And I already used the warden ability, what was I thinking? Ah, that was dumb. Yeah, I kind of forgot that like over here, we have to save the warden ability. That was stupid. But dude, I am really happy about the fact that we... <laughs> Did I miss the dragons? It doesn't matter. It's not going to do much. I had to use the hay spells because um, it was for a challenge, for a season challenge. But I am so happy that we got through this. I mean, we might not get the three star. It looks like we're probably not going to. But uh, yeah, this is cool. This is great. Dang, I really wish we had three-starred this though. Look at how close we are. All we need is just a little bit more. All we need to do really is get that air defense and then we'd be there. Oh man. I don't think it's gonna work though. I don't think it's gonna work. Like all of these troops are just so painfully slow. It is truly painful. It is truly painful to watch the warden at the end of any raid trying to get through some stuff because he's just so slow. And this is why when you get a 99%, it hurts because you're watching this dude just like speed up, please move faster. No, he's on his own time. He's on warden time. Are you kidding, right? <laughs> oh, there we go. Cool. Yo, my, both of my legs are so sore today. I did nothing yesterday. I think I did some push-ups. Yeah, put that in your mind. Beak did some push-ups. Now I'm trying to do like 50 a day, just to, you know, a baseline of like, if I don't do that, I'm gonna just turn into jello. So I gotta at least do something uh, because it's hard to work out right now. You know, you can't go to the gym. Anyway, guys, that is it for today. Thank you for coming out. We love you guys. If you enjoyed this one, let us know in the comments below. Be sure to leave to for Lulu. Join the gang. All you got to do is subscribe. And we'll see you guys right here tomorrow on Beaker's Lab. Peace, gang. <laughs>